Hi everyone, this is Mona Hilton with Advantage Anywhere. I wanna introduce you to my friend, Nancy Like. She is a survivor of Hurricane Ian and I'd love for you to hear her story. So it was quite a shock. I wasn't here when it happened and when I got here, um, I found out that everything was lost and also my daughter and son-in-law's house was lost. We had 47 to inches to five feet of water in our houses. Thankfully, my daughter and son-in-law ended up in my attic for about 16 hours with their two little girls and their dog, and that's how they stayed out of the flood so they were safe, and I'm so grateful and so thankful to the Lord for that. But in the meantime now, there's so much to do that nobody knows anything about. And of course, you start out with the basics. You call your insurance company and you get all your numbers and then you start on the phone. And that is very frustrating. Sometimes the one call, they said I was number 356 in the queue and it'd be a thousand odd minutes before they would get back to me. So that's what people's lives are like, just dealing with trying to get some help in that area. Um, unfortunately, none of us are, have a lot of hope that our insurance is going to cover everything that we lost or even close to that, but my trust is in the Lord, so I'm just going to count on him for what he's going to give me back. Um, besides that, um, right now it's helpful that people can get food and clothing and the, the immediate needs that they have, but in the future, when their houses are rebuilt, every single one of us is gonna to have to replace everything that we ever owned. And that's when people are really, really gonna need help because there probably won't be anybody there for that. But again, I'm just trusting the Lord to just give me what I need. Um, the information is so daunting that, that just is flooding into everyone. It's kind of like you don't know where to go or who to listen to or how to get the information you actually need. So in the future, you know, that's one thing I think that can be improved on definitely is just a basic list to start with on steps on what to do. So it's replacing everything you had, all your paperwork, you know, everything that you just never thought you would have to even think about. So I just thank everyone that has given me help and a place to stay and just the comfort and prayers that we need in this situation. So thank you all for listening and God bless you all. Thank you, Nancy. We appreciate your honesty. We're so sorry for what you've been through. We love you. Love you too. Thanks.